In this video, I'm gonna take you on a tour of a home on the golf course out in Riverview, Florida that has had a $60,000 price reduction. So if you like home tours, stick around. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Josh Bryan and I'm your Tampa Bay area real estate expert. So if you're thinking about making a move, reach out, I would love to help you. My contact information is in the description below. All right, enough talking, let's start today's tour. All right, this one is in the Clubhouse Estates at Summerfield Community in Riverview. It is a four bedroom, three bath, three car garage, 2331 square feet, built in 1990. Originally listed at $495,000 and has been reduced down to $436,000. There is a $472 per year HOA fee, no CDD fee, and the 2022 uh, tax bill was 44.80 for the year. So let me pan around the neighborhood, show you what it looks like, then we will go inside and take a look. All right, let's go inside. So when you first come in, you have your tile floor, vaulted ceilings, and then right here, you're going to have a coat closet. And then the master bedroom is gonna be here, vaulted ceiling up, and then you have your uh, sliding glass doors, covered patio out there. And then you have your bifold doors to go into the bathroom. So when you first come into the bathroom, you have your linen closet there, and then your walk-in closet here. And then right here, you're gonna have your dual vanity. Not a fan. Cabinets are old for sure. Um, or, uh, yeah, I would just rip it all out personally. And what the heck is this? If anybody knows, tell me. Maybe it was a planter or something and they just had you know, some plants there. Then you have your jacuzzi tub here. And then your walk-in shower. Another linen closet. Your toilet. Continuing on, this is gonna be family room slash living room with access to the patio. Here would be your dining room if you wanted it to be that, you could. It's wired for overhead light, there's just no fixture. And right here is going to be another coat closet. And then right out here will be your three car garage. There is a door out to the side yard and then your water heater is tucked in the corner over there. It's a nice big three car garage. Coming in out of the garage and immediately to your right is your laundry room. Continuing on, this could be a dining area as well. And then you have your kitchen here. Let's show you this, usually I don't do this, but this would be your pantry or, yeah, I would use it as the pantry since there's nothing else. And then your stainless steel appliances, it is electric here. And then this could be your main living room slash family room if you wanted to. And then back here to the right will be a bedroom number two. Coming out of there, immediately to the right is going to be 
Bathroom number two, laminate countertops, old cabinets. So I would just rip all that out. But you can do whatever you like. All right, and you have a linen closet here. And then right here would be bedroom number three. Come in the back side back here, you have a deep linen closet or pull the shelves out and just, you know, storage area. And then bedroom number four back here. And then you have bathroom number three right here with a door that goes out to the covered patio. So right out there is the golf course. And here is your covered lanai screened in with three, five entrances to the house. So you can pick and choose and there is only uh, one door to get out of here, which is gonna be over here. I would put a second one on the other side by the master bedroom, but that's just me. All right, and as you can see this tall net, that means there is the driving range. So I don't know how far this is, but there is one ball right over here and several balls up along the net so people can hit it just whether or not they hit it high enough to get around um you know over that net but this is the the backyard here so nice size yard and if you wanted to you could definitely put a pool in here and this is what the back of the property looks like nice big oak tree so that's going to do it for this property. Let me know what you think about it in the comments below. All right, I hope you enjoyed today's tour. If you did, make sure to give the video a thumbs up. Don't forget to leave a comment below. And if you're thinking about making a move, reach out. My contact information is in the uh, description below. But until next video, take care.